Buenos días desde la Ciudad de México a nuestros seguidores que hablan español. Estamos de vuelta en la Ciudad de México desde Colombia y un mes de Cipolite. Hoy desde Condesa. So, hey, come. Hey, come. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of The Way We Saw It. As you just heard, Marty was doing the introduction in Spanish because he is fluent in Spanish compared to me, who is studying Espanol dos semanas de Buenos Aires y una semana Lima. And, but that's just a little bit, but I understand quite a lot already and practicing every day in the daily life. Now we are in Mexico City, as I said before, we are in Condesa, this beautiful part of Mexico City with all these greens here around the little coffees and restaurants and places and we are staying in the hotel Itza 54 again which is a beautiful hotel with little apartments where we can do our own breakfast and I would like to say thank you to all the new followers we have reached I think 1300 now that's quite amazing and makes us also a little bit proud and talking about followers we were in Cipolite another month to relax after Colombia and there were so many people who came towards us and said hey you are the YouTube guys and we have come here to this place because you recommended it so there was uh, Jim Robert, Freddy, uh, the other, do you remember the names? No, sorry for that, but if you see us somewhere, feel free, come to us. It's always great to talk to you and to exchange and uh, yeah, it's really nice to talk to our followers. So in Mexico City, we are going to tick the last boxes now. We will go to a museum. And we are super excited because we got a reservation at a very fancy restaurant where we will have dinner, but I will not tell you yet where this is going to be. And also, being back here in Condesa, remember last time we just left Condesa one day before the big earthquakes actually hit Mexico City. We were already in Puebla. If you haven't seen that video, you can click on the link below. And being back here in Condesa now, seeing so many houses which have collapsed, actually there's one behind me here as well, it hasn't collapsed but it's uh, abandoned, nobody can live there anymore. It's really uh, a pity to see uh, what happened to this part of the city and probably, most, probably also to all the other parts of Mexico City. So let's discover Mexico City, but first start with a good coffee. There's actually a little coffee place which is just very close to our hotel called Chiquitica, <laughs> Chiquitito Coffee. And I personally think it's one of the best, best coffees here in this Condesa area. we came here with an Uber to the Franz Mayer Museum and actually what we didn't know there's a Tim Burton exhibition taking place and there's a super 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 long queue the Uber driver left is actually behind the building and there was already a queue and I couldn't believe that it's for this museum but it is so we're coming back on Tuesday because today is Sunday and hopefully then on Tuesday there are not going to be so many people there's Marty so let's through the city, I guess. Yeah. This church also has suffered from the earthquake. You can see the two towers are totally unstable and broken. And I, I heard that more than 1,000 buildings actually in Mexico City are 
uh, damaged and are empty currently and it's a, quite a big challenge to tear them down or to repair them or restore them or if they can be repaired at all. But it's going to be a big challenge for the next uh, months or probably years. So instead of going to the Franz Mayer Museum, we go to the Museo Nacional del Arte Munal in Mexico City, not far from the Franz Mayer Museum. The entrance is free today, and if you think I look stupid, it's because they asked me to carry my mochila in front. So that's what I'm doing. built in 1900 uh, in the style of an Italian palazzo and this is how it looks like for the moment there's not much art in here but the uh, rooms are pretty impressive especially what you see in the ceiling here is the Museo Nacional de Arte Munal has a lot of national Mexican art uh, one section is mainly religious art and there is a section with Jose Maria Velasco that has a famous painting called The Valley of Mexico, which is the place where we are now. That's where the valley, that's the valley where Mexico City is built. So we will have a look at this and show you some images of this museum. was the day actually we've done something different than planned because the museums we wanted to visit were not available or too busy so here in front of the uh, statue of Charles IV the king of Spain and the Indias we are going to close this vlog for today there is also the post museum or the post house behind us which we want to show you that will be on the next vlog then when we visit the Franz Mayer Museum Thank you for watching. This was the way we saw it again in Mexico City, one of our favorite cities. Uh, we can hope that we come back here again, again and again. There's so much to see. Thank you for watching. Please put the thumbs up and see you soon. Safe travels always. Bye.